today is uh, April 16th, Friday, and yesterday I went down to have an MRI on my knee. As I said in the last uh, vlog that I did to you, the introduction to doing this for the next couple months, I've had a lot of things physically that have been affecting uh, you know, the different athletics that I'm able to do, which ultimately affects how well I'm able to uh, maintain my health and, and my lung capacity and so I haven't been running I would say since about uh, May of last year due to uh, some problems with the knee the medical terminology for it would be my lateral hamstring is sublaxing over my fibular head of my knee but basically uh, on the side of my knee here uh, the lateral hands, hamstring is sublaxing and moving over the fibula head here. And so it's a very strange, very strange problem. And I think it also has to do with uh, the tracking issues in my leg and my knee specifically because uh, the outside muscle here of the thigh is very strong and the inside muscle of, of my leg, the vastus medialis area is very weak. And so when my knee tracks in my walking or my running, it's constantly pulling my knee to the outside um, rather than just being straight up and down. And so this has been my body mechanics for, I mean, my entire life, but I guess over time certain muscles and everything got stronger and my biomechanics ended up uh, sort of conforming to this way. And so basically, <coughs> I'm trying to figure out through this MRI if um, there's actually some damage within this area or if this is just pain because it's gotten so to the point where, you know, my knee is just tracking completely improperly that I need to really take time to do the proper physical therapy that I need to do, um, which in case if... I have been working on certain exercises uh, and starting to go to physical therapy for that, uh, but it's such a it's such a new time for me because you know I used to be I, I'm not running uh, I'm not really I'm not really riding a bike um, and the only th real thing that I have is swimming. Thank God for that because that allows me to <coughs> really still continue to work my lungs, but. Uh, I'm a very a I'm a very active person, and I've uh, being able to run and do these things really helps me push my my lungs. And so when I'm not able to have uh, you know the use of my legs to really be able to push, it's very different. I'm trying to find other exercises that will try to do as much as those others did for my lungs, because obviously, you know, my health is dependent upon my ability to breathe and. I feel like I'm functioning at like 70%. So it's really having the endurance and the patience to, you know, to try to find new ways of exercise in the meantime, try to get this, this healthy. So uh, I got the MRI yesterday on Thursday, and in about two or three days, I should hear the results of, uh, of what it's going to be. So when I get those results, I'll let you know. Thank you for your time. We'll talk to you soon.